Was that you? I'm Stuart Shepard. This is Stoplight. So, the Department of Health and Human Services issues draft guidelines for the upcoming four years, which ordinarily would be about as exciting as that eight-hour slow-motion sheep movie. But it was a slow news day and somebody actually read a little bit of it, and they were shocked, shocked to find government might possibly respect the inherent dignity of persons from conception to natural death. Here's my favorite incredulous headline. In a radical departure, Trump health officials want to define life as starting at conception. Now, if it's a radical departure to get from here to here, isn't it also a radical departure to get from here to here? Just saying. One expert even said, we're replacing science with beliefs. Yikes. It apparently sounds so much like an internet hoax to some people. Even Snopes posted about the radical departure and went so far as to put the word scientific in quotes. Okay, let's summarize. The pro-lifers say they're talking science. The other side says, that's just your beliefs. I thought about quoting scientific experts, but there are experts on both sides of the issue. I thought about quoting medical textbooks, but there are a lot of textbooks in the world. In the end, I think one simple question will clarify the whole thing. Was that you? Now, for illustrative purposes, I'll apply it to myself first. You may ask yourself after the green light. Ten years ago, I started doing stoplight. Was that me? Scientifically, yes. Twenty years ago, I was a TV weather guy. The hair is darker, but was that me? Scientifically, Yes. 40 years ago, I was the least talented member of a Bible college quartet, weighed 165 pounds, had a lot to learn, but was that me? Scientifically, yes. At the very end of the Eisenhower administration, I got my first haircut. I was wholly dependent on others to keep me alive. I didn't have a job. I could hardly speak the language, but scientifically, that's me. I can't go the next step because sonograms weren't a thing yet, but you see where I'm going? Look, science can only ever substantiate the pro-life point of view. To say that at some point in my existence, I'm something other than me, takes us out of science and into philosophy, aka beliefs. Which means that expert has it perfectly, completely backwards. So now, it's your turn. Was that you?